welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my 2021 new year, new me reset video. I know it's cliche to reset in the new year, but I think we all felt like we wanted to put 2020 behind us and embrace a new year, new us, bright future, we hope. I think we can all agree 2020 was a rough year. I definitely started to feel some of the effects of that. I was feeling pretty depressed. I was using some pretty unhealthy coping mechanisms. I was turning to food and I was even drinking a little more than I would like. So in this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you some of the new habits that I've created in 2021 thus far. I feel so much better, so much healthier, so much happier already. Like I'm not even just saying that. So in the mornings, I always come in here, drink my morning coffee not giving up caffeine in 2021, not doing that. I usually check my aura ring and see how I slept the night before, I have my morning coffee and just kind of enjoy this alone time. Well, let me show you my aura ring, hold on. So usually when Izzy and I are sitting here having our coffee, I always, always, always check my aura ring. So that's this thing right here, it tracks my sleep and my steps and that's one of the main things that I am definitely doing in 2021 so far and making sure to get like between 10 and 15,000 steps a day just because like I'm not working out as much I'm not as active as obviously because I'm not like going outside and doing as many things as I used to do. Since I gave up alcohol and like I've been doing more steps throughout the day. So I got a 90 like out of 100 and I have like a little crown there because I slept so well. Um, but anyway, it's time to go to the gym and I'll show you what I've been doing there. So let's go. Here is the Peloton app right here. So what I usually do is I go into running. I'm pretty much always doing like some sort of 30 minute ride. So I'll filter it by length. And my favorite kind to do is usually intervals because it's just more entertaining and quick. And then there you go, it's so easy. I really like it because it's like having a coach in my ear the whole time. So it makes it kind of go by faster. It makes me feel like I'm in a class. You know. Okay everyone, I am back from the gym and it is time for my morning smoothie. I usually come home from the gym and come directly to the kitchen because I'm always starving after a workout and I'm really impatient. So I'm like, let's eat right away. For today's morning smoothie, I'm going to be making this Daily Harvest cold brew and almond. So if you guys are not familiar with Daily Harvest, it is my new favorite thing for 2021. Daily Harvest helps you stock your home with clean and delicious foods. It's all based off whole fruits and whole vegetables. So as you can see in this smoothie, it has banana, almond, coffee, cacao, cacao. <laughs> cacao, coconut, and green coffee, and that's all that's in it. So you basically blend this up with some almond milk and it's ready to go. What's key for me when I'm trying to eat healthier and when I am being healthier is that I'm focusing on what I'm bringing into my diet and not what I'm eliminating, if that makes sense. So instead of focusing on, I'm not going to be eating this, 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 and this, I focus on what am I going to be incorporating instead. So for me, that's eating really clean, whole foods, fruits, vegetables, which is what Daily Harvest is amazing for. It is also totally customizable, so maybe you want more smoothies, maybe you want more bowls. I like having a mix of both in my fridge. And best of all, it's totally delicious. Like everything tastes so good and it's just so convenient. I have it in my freezer all the time and I can just grab it and have something healthy to eat at all times. I already feel so much better in the new year since I've been incorporating this into my diet. It tastes so good. If you would like to try Daily Harvest, you can use my code EMILYD. You can get $25 off your first order. Like I said, Daily Harvest makes it super easy to eat clean consistently. It's super delicious. So let's go. I am fresh out of the shower. Didn't wash my hair because it still is fine. Um, anyway, time for my favorite part of the day, skincare. I'm gonna do a little bit of a vitamin C serum. I'm actually still using this fresh one. If you watched my fresh review, you can go watch it. Um, I just don't wanna waste it and I wanna use it. And I'm run out of my other vitamin C that I love to use that. And I'm gonna do a little bit of moisturizer. And then that is it for skincare. These days I've been keeping it like really, really simple. Obviously like spending a lot of time at home, but you know, I feel like my skin is the happiest when I keep it simple. Comment below if you feel the same way. I mean, of course I'm always torturing it and doing like all of these reviews and trying different routines and products because I just like doing that. But I have a good one coming up soon. You guys will see that I really enjoy making. A little bit of lip balm, aquaphor. Oh, for my moisturizer, I use this 
August, Augustinus Bader. Never know how to say that. It's pretty good, I've been trying it. They sent that to me. I'm also gonna do a little bit of makeup. I've been doing my hair and my makeup and like putting on an outfit. As of lately, if you follow me on Instagram, you've probably noticed like I've been having a little bit of fun, like putting outfits together and you know, like getting ready. I just feel like, you know, I'm obviously not going anywhere. I'm not going to events, I'm not going to castings, I'm not going to work, but like getting ready is just another part of like my wellness routine at this point. Like as much as like eating healthy and all of those things are key, so is this part for me because I just mentally do not feel good if I don't feel put together. So first thing I'm going to do is a little bit of concealer. Curious, like, you know, I just mentioned to you guys getting dressed and getting ready has been like a really big part for me of like feeling well. What are the small things that you've been doing that make you feel well? Like even if it's small things, like sometimes like, even if it is just like doing my hair or cooking a really healthy lunch or going for a nice long walk, like it's like those small things that make me feel like I'm doing a good job kind of like taking care of myself. I guess like my question is, what is your version of self-care right now? What's making you feel good? I'd love to know. I'm doing a little bit of powder foundation. Also, this is like the speediest makeup that I've been doing every day. Then I have this city bronzer, a little bit of this to make it look like I just came back from vacation, which Lord knows I didn't. I'll do a little bit of this in my crease. I'm going to quickly fill in my brows. I kind of just do like the ends like here, just because, you know, it just takes so long to get my brows right. But I'm just trying to make it look like I have some. Doing a little bit of this Maybelline Brow Sculpt to get my brows kind of in place. Cool. A little bit of blush. A little bit of highlighter. Some lip. My hair is pretty much done already, so let's go get dressed. Alrighty, everyone, here is my little, very simple outfit of the day. I'm wearing these A gold jeans and also this top, which I think is by Aster the label. But I like it, it has this like little detail here. Yeah, I mean, I know like getting dressed has not been super easy at this time, but like for some reason, like having fun with my outfits and like, even if it's a simple, I mean, this is just a sweater and jeans, but when I get on a call or a Zoom, or even when I run to the grocery store, I just feel so much better, better and healthier and just like, more myself when I get dressed. But anyway, let's go to my little office and start the day. So I'm officially ready to start my day after all of that. I have Izzy here too. She is never far away. Once I'm finished with kind of my morning routine, working out and you know eating and having my morning coffee and all of that, I like to come into my office and do something creative. It's something that I've been trying to incorporate into my morning routine each day because like doing something creative early on in the day for some reason gets me really fired up and it makes me feel inspired and like excited for the rest of my day, if that makes sense. So for me, that's sometimes writing, sometimes Sometimes it's planning something, editing a video, which I have to do now, like editing one of my outfit videos that I've been posting on Instagram, which I really like creating. But yeah, being creative is like kind of my favorite part or aspect of what I do that makes me feel motivated and excited. Sometimes it's hard to like get into it, but you know, I really enjoy it and it makes me feel great the rest of the day. I think like wellness and feeling well in 2021, you know, I mentioned earlier in the video, it's like the workouts that I'm doing and the foods that I'm eating and eating whole foods, more fruits, more vegetables, but also spiritually, mentally, you know, doing something creative every day. That's part of it for me. That's part of wellness, getting dressed, you know, doing my hair and makeup, feeling somewhat put together is part of, is these are all things that are part of my wellness routine, if that makes sense. I'd love to know what your wellness routine is, 
years, whether it's 2020 or 2021, like what you do that makes you feel well and taken care of. You know, in 2021, recently started to go to therapy consistently. And I, I've i been to therapists in the past, but I've never done like the full real thing like consistently. And I've only done it like when I felt like I needed it, if that makes sense. Like when I was sad about something or stressed about something specific or going through something specific. And now I'm going once a week. I literally go at 7 a.m., which is so crazy. It's also like TMI. I have no idea if you guys care. Um, but I share that because I think 2020 was a rough year, a complicated year. Um, but I think, you know, figuring out what it is that makes you feel well and taken care of is so important, whether that be just like eating healthier and working out, or maybe you need a talking to someone. For me, it's all of those things, a little bit of everything. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed sharing my updated morning routine with you guys. I hope that you are well, stay healthy in 2021. Let me know in the comments section below what other kinds of videos you would like to see from me. You know, I'd love to vlog more on here and share more of my life with you on here, whatever is that you want to see i want to share it um but anyway don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time bye <gasps> can you tell them to subscribe to our channel if he says please subscribe <laughs>